I'm Jay. And I'm John. And we're Bucket List Travellers, coming to you from Samoto Canyon in Nicaragua. And today we're going on a day trip to Samoto Canyon. Which is north of Nicaragua. And it's supposed to be a really beautiful area. You do hikes and then you go swimming in the canyon. So we're really looking forward to it. We've been living in Nicaragua for almost a year now. And we've been keen to really discover Nicaragua and explore more of this beautiful country. The more we see of it, the more we're impressed by all that it has to offer. There are currently 78 protected areas in Nicaragua, which have been recognised as important natural resources for the country. These protected areas make up 17.3% of Nicaragua's land mass and are important for Nicaragua's growing ecotourism industry. We'll be uploading a new video each week, so to get more great Nicaragua travel inspiration, don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> Canyon de Samoto is in the north of Nicaragua in the Madrid department. It's a four or five hour drive from Granada via the Pan American Highway and you go through some beautiful Nicaraguan countryside as well as the cities of Sabaco, Esteli and Samoto. If you want to travel here by bus, you can get a bus to the city of Samoto at the Mayoreo Market in Managua. The canyon itself is 15 minutes drive west of Samoto city. Our first stop is at Commodore Buffet called Casa Sola uh, and we're having breakfast. It's about two hours into the trip and the sun has just risen. It's freezing. It's pretty cold. Up in the mountains. We started this trip with a four o'clock wake up call and it's now about six o'clock in the morning. So we're going with Danny's tours and they're based in Granada. We got picked up from right out the front of our home and there's an air-conditioned bus which seats about 20 people. It's been a really nice tour so far and it's nice to see the sun coming out. A bit chilly in the mountains, but looking forward to seeing what the rest of the countryside has to offer. Close to wash your hands, there's toilets, and we're just about to get in line for breakfast. Eggs, we've got cheese and Maduro, which is sweet, sweet banana. The base for our tour was Cabanas Gabriela, which is located right next to Samoto Canyon. After arriving at Samoto Canyon, your first stop will be this little house and restaurant where you're provided with some coffee, coffee. Uh, some biscuits and a much needed restroom stop. Yeah, because it was a four hour ride to get here, very scenic ride. Really but... nice going through the mountains and the little towns and cities along the way. Yeah, so it's about 10.30 now and it's a, to be honest, it's a bit cooler than I expected it to be. So it's probably around 24, 25 degrees Celsius. Yeah, pleasant, very pleasant. So when you get here, you'll need to change into the clothes that you want to wear into the canyon. And when you get into the canyon, you will be going actually through the water. So just bring stuff that you don't mind getting wet. And the rest of the stuff you can leave on the bus, which should be secure. Just got our instructions, albeit in Spanish, so I think we're going for a three kilometre walk, then we're going to go for a bit of a swim. Swim or a boat ride, not sure, we're going to find out very soon. Uh, and then lunch sometime, so altogether it's 15 kilometres, so hopefully we're not walking all that way. And we get life vests as well, so it should be fun. Samoto Canyon is one of the newest tourist attractions in Nicaragua. Locals refer to this area as the structure, or Nanancabre, 
and it's only been recently utilized for tourism after geologists from Nicaragua and the Czech Republic discovered it in December 2004. The 170 hectare area around the canyon was declared a national monument of Nicaragua in 2006 and it is growing in popularity as a Nicaragua sightseeing destination for both locals and foreigners visiting Nicaragua. It's a beautiful day to be walking in the countryside and it's an absolutely spectacular area. Yeah, it's really pretty and you can see we've got our masks off so we're making sure we're keeping our social distance and it's, it's really good to get in the fresh air and it's a beautiful day for it too. So it's probably about 25 degrees Celsius. Oh, and it's just so nice to be able to see a little bit of a different side of Nicaragua because mm. uh, we have been in Granada for almost all of the last year. Yeah, it's, it's amazing how much the terrain changes across the country. So we're in the drier, cooler part of the, the country, more hilly. There is a scenic half hour hike through the Solis Valley that takes you to the bottom of the canyon. We didn't realise how close we were to the Honduras border you can actually see Honduras from the hiking trail. Being at the bottom of the canyon here is actually quite breathtaking. The drop off of the cliffs is quite stunning. And the flow of the water, it's just a really pretty place to be. Samoto Canyon is actually one of the oldest rock formations in Central America and is believed to have formed between five and 13 million years ago. This is just such a beautiful hike. And when you come here, make sure you bring shoes with some solid grip because there's a lot of rocks on the path and it does get very slippery. It looks like we're coming to the end of the dry part of the tour. So we've just been asked to put our stuff in the dry bags, the communal dry bags, and we're going to start getting into the water. Mm -hmm. As you can see behind me, people are starting to get into the water. So you wade about um, halfway up your calf in the water. Uh, so it's a bit slow going, but take your time, enjoy the scenery and stay safe. Our tour guide Juan was a very friendly and helpful guy. He's run tours in the canyon for a number of years now, and business has been pretty slow since the start of COVID. We highly recommend getting in contact with Juan for a tour. You can find his details in our description. We're with Juan here, who is a guide from Somoto Canyon Tours. Hola amigos, ¿qué tal? Bienvenidos a Somoto Canyon Aventura Extrema. Hoy nos encontramos felices porque estamos con nuestros amigos australianos, sí. John y Jan. Sí. Eh, son bienvenidos a conocer nuestro sitio, invitándolos a todos, a los seguidores de que tienen ellos, dándoles un saludo a todo el mundo y que esperamos que se encuentren bien. Gozando de buena salud y esperando los que nos visiten pronto en Somoto Cañón, Aventura Extrema. Un saludo, mucho gusto. Gracias. Gracias. How's the water temperature, John? Perfecto. It's really nice. Okay, getting in. I haven't brought a spare pair of my shoes with me, so it's going to be a bit uncomfortable for the rest of the day. really relaxing, floating on the water, having a lovely time. If you can, slide down these cascades, it's a lot more fun. This is such a cool experience, I'm so glad we got to come here. This is really fun going in and out through the canyon. Uh, it's a little bit colder than normal today in Nicaragua and it makes it quite fresh when you're jumping in the water, jumping out of the water, but it's still really fun. I 
It's a really nice turquoise, it's so pretty. It's like wave rock in Australia. We did the Samoto Canyon tour with Danny's Tours. Danny runs his tours out of Granada and seeks out experiences for customers that promote other local businesses and the community. Great pleasure to introduce Danny from Danny's Tours. So Danny, tell us all about the well, tours. Yes, uh, thank you guys for joining us to this adventure. We are here at Cañons de Somoto, which is a national uh, monument. And it was discovered in 2004. And mm. this is a wonderful place. So I invite you to come with us and organize. we organize the tours. We're working on this for the last seven years. Uh, we're a local tour company, so you're more than welcome to come with us. Awesome, thanks very much. You're welcome. We'll also put Danny's tour details in the description for you. Make sure you check them out when you're next in Granada and looking to have some fun adventures. We're about to go for another swim and it's a little bit cold, but it's still an amazing tour. You can see John's getting hypothermia. His lips are blue. No, uh, I'll be okay. But it's, it's just so cool seeing the canyon. It's just a really stunning area. Yeah, definitely. I love it. going to need to auto stabilize this on freezing. I never thought that I'd have freezing and Nicaragua in the same sentence. So after about an hour and a half of swimming through the canyon, it's time to get into the boats. That was a really fun boat ride. Yeah. And we got lots of sun, so can't say. Warming up. Yeah, I'm warming up. <laughs> it's really nice being back on land. The swim was good but it was getting a little bit cold for my liking. Oh, the sun's out now and it's beautiful. I think we're nearing the end of this walk and there's a really cute little pathway to cross the last little stream. For lunch we've got res or beef, as well as pollo, the chicken. So it looks really nice, it's a really big serving. And we also have uh, tostones, which are the bananas. They're sort of like banana chips. So I'm really excited and I'm really hungry. Cheers. Hmm. <laughs> Need to remove this. We left at about 4 p.m. for the long trek back to Granada, stopping at a gas station for a restroom stop and some dinner before reaching Granada just before 11 p.m. Two enchiladas for 25 Cordovas each just outside the Uno gas station on our small toilet break in, I think it's called Savoco. If you like this video, please click the like button and don't forget to subscribe. We are Bucket List Travellers. See you next time. <laughs>